Hi there, and welcome to Friday of our week of prayer and fasting. Today we are entering into uh, the theme of being more prayerful. Now, that may seem strange that we're doing, that we're praying about being more prayerful, but we know that anything that is hard or difficult, ultimately we want to come to the Lord with. So we're going to specifically pray for this as a church, that we as a church would move forward in this way. So I want to encourage you to take some time today and pray for these three points. And what we're going to do is I'm going to tell you what the point is to pray. And I encourage you to pause the video and just pray. Just pray right then and there. I'll stop talking and you can just pause it. And then when you're ready and when you've prayed about that point, come back and push play and enter into the next point. First off, we want to pray about not just being a church that says we pray or people that say that we pray. We don't just say it with our mouths but that we ultimately take our cares and our concerns to the Lord before we talk about them to anybody else. So I wanna encourage you to pause right now and pray for that. Next up, we wanna pray for, uh, that we would realize that our biggest struggles are fought in our prayers to the Lord. That no matter how big the thing that we're facing, we know that we know it in our hearts, that we believe it, that we act on it, that our prayers ultimately do impact these big situations and that going to the Lord with them does matter. So let's just pause right now and pray for this. And lastly, we want to pray that, that we fight the lies of the enemy, that when he tells us these prayers do not matter, that they do not impact lives, whether it's our own life, whether it's the lives of our family and friends, or even the lives of people around the world. Those are lies of the enemy that we can believe in, so we want to fight against those. So let's take that to him in prayer right now. Thank you so much for joining in this time of prayer today. I, I encourage you to keep praying for these things in the rest of the day, but in the days to come as well. Uh, you can hang on to these prayer points and keep continuing to pray for them as a con for our congregation in the, in the months to come. So thank you for joining us and be back tomorrow uh, for a video from Pastor Andrew to wrap up our week of prayer and fasting.